So, one of the unique parts of Michigan's massively popular college football tradition is you cannot buy a beer inside the stadium. Well, now Lansing lawmakers are saying it's probably a good time to make a new tradition. Look for is Rob Maloney live tonight with how they're trying to lift the ban on alcohol sales during the games. Hey, Rod. Hi, Karen. You know, there's no shortage of beer at a football game, particularly a college football game in the state of Michigan, but they have to drink it in the tailgate in, in, in that brings the entire stadium before or after. But the legislators are taking a look at this thing. You know, maybe that's not the healthiest thing we could be doing. The college football tailgate is as much a part of the game as the opening kickoff. Yet for Bill's sponsor, Republican Clinton County State Representative Graham Filler. So I feel like Michigan is behind the times when it comes to alcohol sales at games. He believes the experiments other Big Ten schools have done in allowing in-game sales have worked. And we, as a state, should join in. College events are just something we love. And uh, beer and sports go together like... Um, I don't know, like American cherry pie. Yet for co-sponsor, Democratic State Senator Sean McCann of Kalamazoo, with crowd sizes often bigger than the pros. So I think this makes uh, really the, the the experience of going to a college uh, sporting event uh, better. Uh, it gives an option for people who want to do this like they would at a uh, professional sporting event. Perhaps more interesting is the idea that there's bipartisan support for much of anything in Lansing. Yet for Democratic Ypsilanti State Representative Jimmy Wilson, it's a way to address fan safety as well. Uh, out in the parking lot where you have people trying to uh, kind of binge drink before a college sporting event. And that can lead to a lot of unintended consequences out in the public uh, or also potentially in the stadiums. Now, universities stand to make money doing this. I reached out to a number of programs, U of M, MSU. Uh, nobody wants to talk about any of this. They're all saying that essentially it's all happening up in Lansing. And for now, that's where they'll leave it. Back to you. All right. We appreciate it, Rod. Thank you. So